Come on, come on, look at me. Come on, look at me. Fun, didn't you? Yeah, I guess. Oh, stop. Really hurting us. Do you guys want anything? Oh. Yes, champagne. <laughs> the wedding party starts now, Mrs. Braithwaite. Oh. But, you know, if I bloat and I don't fit into that dress, this is on you. Oh, that is completely true. You know, I do think you'll put on about 10 pounds, so how about I have your glass? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, is Lisa okay? Well, she might be a little better if she wasn't paying for the gas. She, okay. <laughs> Run! <laughs> She's so funny. Um, number one, please. Forty pounds, twenty p. Just the best. Hey, Lisa. Hey, I've got this. No, it's fine. I, it's your wedding present. <laughs> don't say I didn't get you anything. Thank you. Okay, look. Is this because you think it's, that I? I, I didn't want to talk about. Thank you. <laughs> no, that is, <laughs> you can't do that. <laughs> That's oh. Oh, did you see that creep in there? You've got to stop being nice to these oh, people. Come on. I did something nice and then it turned into being curved on. Well, you're asking for it. Gonna be late. Come on. Ladies. Oh. <laughs> yes. 
you talking about? <laughs> All right. Oh. Yeah, I know you can. Oh you my god. Die. Die. What the hell? Keep your eyes to yourself, creep. in each other, huh? Stupid question. <laughs> you not spoken much? She hardly called. So. Hey, don't make it too obvious that you don't want to be here, okay, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine. You're not excited to be maid of honor? Yeah. Well, she hasn't asked. Here we go. Thanks. <laughs> How are we doing for gas? Oh, yeah, fine. It doesn't take much for this car to pack in, though. Mm -hmm. Would be helpful if all the pubs had Wi-Fi. Okay, here. Welcome to the countryside. Ooh. <laughs> I hate the countryside. <laughs> hey, you. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's, it's good. How's it looking there? I can't wait to see you. Yeah. Uh, I've, I gotta go. Yeah, okay. Uh, love you too. Bye. from gas station? Yeah. here, isn't it? Really? Mm. Yeah. It's creepy. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> right, so if you take this path here, yeah, yeah, we should get on the right track. So maybe we can chop off a few hours? Um, we could try the back roads. Okay. Oh, yeah. Come on, <laughs> Melissa! <laughs> if we don't hurry, Brandon might marry someone else. Hey! Like me, baby. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> All right, let's go. Oh, she's she's ready. <laughs> Oh my god, is that the guy from the gas station? That's his fucking car. What are we gonna fucking do? Oh, fuck this shit. What? Oh my god. Hey! Hey, weirdo! Are you gonna move your car or what? So.
We need to call the cops. Oh my God, you're gonna take me away. No, they're not. It's gonna... your fault. Come on. No, no, give me that. Give me that. What? No. We need to call the yeah. cops. We need to tell them what happened. If we just leave it, it'll no. get worse. No, it wasn't our fault, okay? Yes, but if we leave his body, then no one would believe us. Alia! Would you rather be him on the ground or you? Because I would much rather it be him. Then what the hell do we do? <laughs> oh, we shouldn't be doing this. We need to get as far away from here as we can. Running out of fucking gas. Oh, shit. Now do we call the cops? Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh hi, officer. Fucking can you help us? We're going to a wedding. We have a fucking dead body in our trunk. Okay, no fucking signal anyway. No, babe, but seriously, if you have any other suggestions, I'm all ears. Hey, guys, there's a house. I don't know. No, no, it's a good idea. Okay, we're lost. We have no idea where we're going, so at least somebody might be able to give us directions. isn't exactly a fucking spa day, is it? No. Come on, come on. Okay, we'll be on our way again soon. Okay, what we need to do is we need to find out where we are. We need to get some gas. Get, we need to get rid of the body. Clean ourselves up, get to the wedding, and we can say that we, that we got stuck in traffic or something yeah yeah exactly yeah okay okay right come on you guys we need to pull ourselves together okay 
All of us. Okay. Come on, come on. I don't think anyone's here. Hello? I'm so sorry. Hello, dears. Oh, we're, we're lost. I shan't imagine you'd be here otherwise. <laughs> well, we're running low on gas. Can you help? Do I look like a petrol station? We were hoping you could point us in the right direction. But well, there's nothing around here for miles and miles. I mean, I'd offer you a telephone, but you see, I don't have anyone to ring, so. Well, I may know someone who can help. Are you ladies coming in? Uh, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. The garden comes on Wednesday. I don't have many guests, but if you girls wish to stay then, I'm sure he can source some petrol and get you on your way then. Oh, <laughs> how rude of me. My name is Miss Perkins. I have very strict rules. You see, I'm not used to visitors, having always lived here alone. I like my routines. Dinner is served at six, and lights are out at eight. Sweet. Have uh, you ever been married, Miss Perkins? Me? <laughs> no. Marriage doesn't mean very much, in my opinion. A romantic fiction. <laughs> but <laughs> what do I know? I'm just an old lady living in the middle of nowhere. No one to save me and no one to let me down. I take pleasure in the finer things. Reading, cooking, farming, hunting. You see, it is possible to live without the need of another. Well, this looks uh, yummy. Yeah, thank you so much. I do what I can. I hope your stay is equal to your liking. Respect my rules, and I'll respect you girls' space. She seems a little odd. Yo, yeah, well, she seems nice enough to let us stay. It's a bigger, nice person. It'll be fine. Hey, look, I've been thinking. I don't think we need to keep driving. I think we're deep enough. You know, if, if we can't, can't get the car fixed before. And we'll be back. 
Colin will come Wednesday morning. We can get to the wedding. Without anyone knowing anything. Where? I don't know in the woods. <gasps> Do we have to like, you know, cut up the box? Gina! What the fuck, Gina? This is a fucking Dexter. I don't know. Do you reckon we can sneak out without her noticing? <laughs> Lights out in five, girls. I said lights out. I really need to call Brandon. We were supposed to arrive hours ago, you know? What will his parents be thinking? What would mom and dad think? Well, you don't need to worry about that, do you? Look, Lisa, I was wondering. Yeah. Well, I was hoping you'd be my maid of honor. Took you long enough. Well, it's just that you know me and Brandon. Yeah, Eddie. It's fine. Of course. I thought I said you were sleeping on the floor. Well, my back was hurting. Fine. But don't get any ideas. Stop 
being a creeper. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I thought last time was a one off. Yeah, it was. Just like the time before that. You want to do this here? In this creepy house? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wanted you. Are they? <laughs> I didn't think they were. I think Gina likes her a little more. You can't say anything, okay? <laughs> <laughs> in the shed.
Oh. Morning. Toast and honey, good for the spirit. I do apologise. You know, there's not a lot to do around here. Um, I mean, I have all sorts of books and, well, more books. And, um, well, I mean, you can enjoy the weather, but I would stay away from the woods. They're quite the maze. Easy to get lost and hard to find your way back. Hmm. Uh, thank you. Yes, this, thank you. Yes, yeah, so looks nice. amazing. Okay, we need to start digging. Okay, we need to find a shovel or something. Did you not hear what she just said in there about the woods? Oh, come on. Have you got any better ideas? Look, if she doesn't see us leave, what does it matter? Guys, I don't think I can do this. It's okay, you don't have to. I'm sorry, I just don't think I can do all the body. It's sorry. fine, you don't have to. Right, well, we need to find a spade or something. We could look in the shed. What? We're not looking in the fucking shed. What if someone's in there? Talia? We could knock. Yeah. No fucking shed. No, we have to find something else. But now I kind of want to look in the shed. If one does not hunt, one does not eat. Uh, Miss Perkins, uh, maybe you could give us a tour of the woods. I hunt alone. I always have and I always will. I'm setting my ways, Tina. Uh, it's Gina. Yes, well. Catch you soon. Okay, we are not going into the woods. Oh, come on. Oh, yeah. Hi, Miss Perkins. Here we are in the woods with a fucking dead body. <sighs> you guys get a spade. I'm going to check on Lisa. Yeah. <sighs> come on. I guess this is as bad a place as any. The worst. Lisa. You okay? Ethan, Miss Perkins really likes picture frames or there's something she's trying to hide or forget. Okay, well, I think we just need to give her her space. I... Why have all the frames? I don't know. She said she doesn't have visitors. Maybe she just doesn't care. Come on, why don't we catch up outside? We haven't caught up in ages. Yeah, and whose fault is that? Tell me what you've been doing. How's your singing going? I haven't sang since I was 14. Lisa, don't go in there. That's Miss Perkins' room. Lisa. It's not very organized for someone who likes their routines. Yeah, well, she doesn't have visitors, so and especially not in here. Oh, 
what's that? Six-year-old man, Connor Perkins, is missing after a double murder in his family home. Mr. Perkins is suspected of murder in both his wife, Susan Perkins, and her lover, Chris Murray, after the police found them in the shed together with blunt trauma to the head. His daughter is also in critical care and remains in Bamshire Hospital. Connor Perkins is believed to have called the police prior to his escape. It remains a lot. Mrs. Perkins lost her parents too. I just think that's who's in the shit. Connor. I hope he gets a shower before the wedding tomorrow. <laughs> Grave digging, followed by a car journey with you guys. It's just, well, yeah. Feels weird, doesn't it? Talking about a wedding now. It's fucked. Guess it's good to talk about other things, though. I think it's you that's talking. Hey, uh, how's your catch? <laughs> I am a catch. <laughs> well, so you're gonna leave me to go and catch the bouquet? I'm kidding. Look, Gina. I, I just, I, I like you. I. You can be honest. I just don't know what I want. Okay? Got a funny way of showing it. Oh, let's get married, Gina. I'm so excited by the idea of marriage and the smell of grave digging. I can't wait to tell all of our grandchildren what amazing... Yeah, I get it. I get it. Do you? I don't think you do. Does any of this actually fucking bother you? Lisa's fucked. I, I don't even know what Melissa's thinking. But you... Me? Yeah. What the fuck are you thinking? I just want us to... To be what? To live happily ever after? And I don't know how you can stand there and, and pretend that, and that we can be some... You hadn't got out of that goddamn car! Fuck you! Oh, really? Are you done? You can dig your own fucking grave. You guys come and help me move the body. Where's Talia? I don't want to talk about it.
what we're done with, yeah? Hey, go, 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 go. Quick, quick, quick. What the fuck? So what if he fucking calls the police, So right? what if he calls yes. the police? He attacked Shh. you! He attacked you? Why'd you fucking care? What do, what do I get? You... Oh my god, are you serious? I can't fucking deal with you right now. He's calm down. Okay, Talia is missing in the fucking woods, okay? She How is do missing. You, know that? She... you don't care? Of course I care. No, you don't care. You just care about that stupid body. So what's going on with you two anyway? I don't know, nothing. Nothing? Yeah, nothing. Didn't sound like nothing. <laughs> Did you hear that? Yeah, <laughs> thanks. Uh -uh. Sorry. You know, she's probably just pulling one of her pranks. I wouldn't be surprised if she comes back in like two minutes time. Seriously. Oh, oh God. <laughs> we really have to sort this out. Did you catch anything? Not exactly. I hope you like vegetables. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Where are your friends? Oh, uh, Lisa is inside and... Um...
Alice said very clearly, you should not go into the woods, and you walk into the woods. It's like a maze. Like a maze, yeah. Yeah, we get it. Even I would not venture past my regular routes. Do you have any family, Miss Perkins? My family have all passed away, sadly. Sorry. What for? Well, my mother. She was a wicked woman. Drove my father right up the... Whatever words you young things use these days. At least, that's what I hear. I didn't really remember my family. I was too young. And did you live here as a family? Yes. Sorry. It's just that uh, I lost my family as well. My parents. I do apologize for not having a telephone. <clears throat> but tomorrow, Our gardener will, hopefully, he'll be able to, to get your car ready and, um, and put you in touch with the police and then maybe, um, they will find your friend. <laughs> I appreciate this is all very difficult. Do you? I have let you into my house. Do not be bitter with me. And you wonder why I don't like visitors. Oh, my God. 
I don't know what we're gonna do. Even if we get gas tomorrow, Talia is not here. Surely she would have been home by now. I had the most incredible day planned for us. I followed by an early night so I could be ready for the big day. I get you something. What? Something old. Gina coordinated. What are you talking about? She knows something old, something new, something borrowed, something blue. She thought in as I'd known you the longest I should something old. Let's just get through tonight. Uncle the gardener will come, he'll fix the car. Get on our way, we'll get you married, and then we'll fuck off and we'll never speak about this again, okay? Okay. Lisa, go to sleep now. Oh, yeah?
time is it? It's 11. She's Gardner. Gina! Gina! Oh, 
unheard message. They told me you didn't come. When they said you didn't turn up, I didn't believe them. Mm -hmm. This is what I've done. I wasn't even going to call, but... I just wanted to know that you were okay. If you don't want to get married, or it's too fast, or it's too soon, then... That's fine. I love you. the same you and I as I have secrets too all my secrets secrets he knows you're here now dear he knows he knows that you've all been in this house oh. Oh. I told you all not to be seen, didn't I? I told you. My, my dress. <laughs> Oh. <sighs> 
three blind mice See how they run See how they run They all run after the farmer's wife Who cut off their tails with a carving knife Did you ever see such a thing in your life As three blind mice
I need the stray cleaned now. 